Hey guys, I'm Johnny Wright and I am here with Miss Delaware Renee Bull and she has a full sew in with her imports and it looks very natural and one of the reasons why it looks so natural is because of the small braiding and uh, that is one of the tips I always tell people if you're getting a sew in make sure the stylist is giving you small braids because if it's a thick chunkier braids it doesn't have a natural flow and the second thing is to give it a great cut and to make it look as natural as possible and that's what we're going to do first before we do any styling we're going to give her a great cut and then we're we'll going to the tussle messy look is what I'm going to create for you today okay she's already been cut you see it looks very natural it has a natural feel to it and um, we're ready to do some styling and I'm doing a tousled messy look and this is a look that you see a lot of celebrities wear whether they're in street wear or on the red carpet um, you can even take it up to a glam affair if you wanted to like have it messy pin up a little side it is a really fun and easy to do look so I hope you all get it it's a really um, uh, fun look that a lot of people are just wearing on a daily basis but um, I really want to show you all how to do it with her imports, okay? So let's get started. Now I normally don't use a lot of product when it comes down to uh, extensions because you know, extension hair, especially her imports, is, is strong and only her holds a curl, but product will work in styling in this particular look. Um, so I use a little bit of a holding spray and I put it on to the hair just to get the finished look that I want. I have two separate curling irons here. Now, it's not necessarily for brand, it's just because of the size. This is a little bigger and this is a little smaller. This helps create that look that I'm talking about. Um, because, you know, when it's messy and not too constructed, you wanna kinda like different shapes in the waves and the different size curling irons can do it. So if your hair is shorter, you can go with smaller curling irons. I'm gonna start off with my larger iron and I simply go right on top here and create my first wave. like that. All right, let that sit for a minute to make sure that wave sets in. And then I go right underneath. So you can see I'm just basically taking the iron back and forth down the shaft. You see this wave that you created? That's what you're going for. You're going to break this up later, but until you get it all done, just let that sit and settle. So it's just sort of like you're setting the hair. Okay, so now I dropped my second section. This is the way that I created with the first section with the bigger iron. And now I'm gonna go in with the smaller iron. I'm gonna break these two up because that's a little too large. Again with my holding spray. And just do the same thing with my smaller iron. Going up and down the shaft, creating this nice wave that's gonna give us this tousled, messy look. If you all notice, I, I, we left just a little bit of Renee's hair out of top, right around the part area. I like doing that because I think it looks more natural when you can see the scalp, but her imports have um, closures as well too, and they look very good. The scalp mimics your scalp very good. So if you wanted to get a closure, if you wanna put all your hair away, in a full sew in you could but this is still a full sew in it's just a little bit of our hair left out around the hairline and the parting so i'm just going to finish out here the last section in this area just giving it that again messy tassel look all right guys i am done and she looks amazing <laughs> um it hasn't been calmed out yet you still see it looks great right so um, this is the finished product of the Tassel Messy Look. Again, she has a full sew in with her imports. Um, the tips that I gave you, I'll just refresh you. Small braids are important. That gives you more of a natural flow. And then you want to make sure you cut it properly using techniques like glide cutting, point cutting, and also razor cutting because it mimics natural hair. You know, natural hair has split ends and that's what you want to mimic with um, extensions as well too. Because if you cut it blunt, that just, it just doesn't look natural. And then you go in and do the technique I showed you to get this tousled look. You go back and forth with two different sides, curling iron, and you get this beautiful finished look. Again, red carpet ready, street ready. She can wear this anywhere. And I think she looks amazing. This is just beautiful. Like one, two, three. Thanks guys. 
I'm Johnny Rice, her import, and Miss Delaware, Renee Bull. Thank you so much for watching, and make sure you tune in again soon.